Hello everyone, welcome to back my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. He was a vocal force to be reckoned with during his incredible season 24 run on The Voice, but Huntley's career is only getting started. After his victory in December 2023, Huntley hit the ground running performing all around the country and pouring passion into each of his energizing sets. Whether he is rocking out during an NFL national anthem or penning a heart-wrenching ballad, he continues to amaze with his magnetic showmanship. So what all has Huntley has been doing since he won the show? Following the life-changing win, Huntley took to Instagram to thank the viewers who helped him thrive. I love you guys. Thank you for believing in me. Going into this, my only expectation was to go out there and create a moment, Huntley shared. I'm trying to still wrap my head around all of this honestly, and I'm just so grateful for not only this opportunity but the relationships and bonds I made along the way. Season 24 of The Voice was definitely one for the history books. God is good. Huntley first sang the national anthem at the December 2023 Buffalo Bills versus Los Angeles Chargers game and then performed at the halftime show. He later shared a video of his performance on Instagram. In January 2024, he was asked to perform the national anthem at the wildcard game between the Philadelphia Eagles and the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Before relocating to Fredericksburg, Virginia, Huntley had lived in Spring Hill, Florida, just outside of Tampa, and as a longtime fan of the local team, Huntley achieved a major dream with his performance. If you know me, you know my whole life I've been obsessed with two things, one being music, and the other is my love for the Buccaneers. Huntley wrote on Instagram alongside a baby picture of him repping a Buccaneer uniform. I found out this week that I'll be singing the national anthem for primetime football on Monday night for the wildcard game between the Buccaneers and the Eagles. God is so good. In January 2023, Huntley took his rousing vocals to Manteo, North Carolina, to perform two high-energy shows at the historic Pioneer Theater. He was elated to get the opportunity to reenact Andy Griffith's iconic stance while putting his name up on the mark, sharing the moment on Instagram. The Pioneer Theater was such an amazing venue, and I'm glad I got to start this new journey right here. Huntley captioned another Instagram post with pictures from the performance. Here are some shots from both the shows this weekend. We'll be posting a lot of behind scenes from this all week long, just to show you how special this little town is. Along with Huntley other performances in Las Vegas and beyond, he also performed at his first festival in March 2023, joining the lineup of Arizona's Out of the Park Music Festival. So excited for my first festival of the year, Huntley shared with fans during his Instagram announcement. Can't wait to see you, Arizona. Huntley also joined a lineup of former voice artists for an exciting three-day concert series in Nashville at Blake Shelton's Old Red Restaurant alongside fellow former competitors like Alexander Kay, Jay Coot, and Lana Scott. He shared a video of the performance to Instagram in which he tore down the house with a soulful cover of Alex Clare's Too Close. While music is always on the mind for Huntley, he is also a proud father of two children, a daughter, Stella, who was six when her father first auditioned for The Voice, and his son, Michael, born in 2021. Stella made an adorable appearance during Huntley's blind audition, ultimately helping her father choose Niall Horan as his coach. I think that my main concern is to take a step back and just breathe and just really take everything in, Huntley told Entertainment Tonight in December 2023 after he won. This experience has taken half a year. I've spent six months away from my kids. My son is speaking in full sentences now. It's insane, but this has all been so worthwhile. I just want my career. Huntley chatted with NBC Insider about his insane ride to victory admitting the victory wasn't his primary mission. Huntley's focus has always been on creating music and performing, but
but the honor of claiming the season 24 crown was a delightful surprise. Hunley has since revealed that Horan made a significant impact on the way he approaches making music now. Horan definitely helped me find out what my brand is, and also where my brand can branch off to, Huntley told NBC Insider. I definitely want to stay true to my rock and roll roots, but I've shown that I can also jump into the mainstream with records like Way Down We Go, Daylight, and also Another Love. This man knows how to pick songs, I'll tell you that.